Hi, tubers. Bleach PC Mike here. Thought I'd show you my ad for from the 80s, early to late 80s. I picked up on eBay a while ago. This is already up there, but I figure I'm just making a video because I got some new subs. Most people might not have seen this. It's, it's an ad for uh, Stamper Hivac, and uh, yeah, it basically says Stamper Hivac Riders the ultimate long grooming. The vacuum power lifts the grass blades into the cutting unit so you get a smooth cut e and even bag cuttings even during the moisture conditions the two large capacity grass catchers are available as options uh, six bushel rear mounted model or gigantic 30 bushel training bag in a wagon or on many lawns saving option is a fat save is it, uh, saving option is a thatcher for removing thatch, which prevents your lawn from getting air, food, and water it needs healthy to grow. The rear engine high vac rider gives you uh, cutting tight places go, gives you good uh, immediate response for uh, adjusting and, and cutting height and uh, messed up. Got distracted. There's a UPS guy. I thought it was a package for me. Uh, the rear engine rider, high vac rider, gives you a smooth, even cut plus immediate response for steering and cutting into tight places. On the, the go adjustment for cutting height and speed for floating cutting unit, which minimizes scalping and damage. See your local stamper dealer. Yellow pages are right. Yeah, I thought this was neat. Other ones are more money, and so there's a uh, four bucks. And yeah, these snapper tractors there. You can, if you ever find one of those, all these things right there had the rubber disc set up. But yeah, I, th I just thought these were cool because my uncle had one when I was little, and I was kind of fascinated by it when I was young. Five or eight, he had them, and picked up mine, and yeah, the rest is uh, history. I love. My old stuff. Here's something I spent thirty dollars on. I'll show you in a minute. Mind when I get done explaining. Mind you that I probably should have took the thirty dollars and bought a put it towards a, an engine or another project. That is uh my stamper toy. Oh yeah, paid thirty dollars for this on eBay. It's from the late eighties. It has a copyright date of nineteen eighty eight on it. A little dusty it's sitting in my room and uh, these were sold at uh, tractor supply uh, in the late 80s it's got a bag or two and it's made out of die cast I think the wheels are rubber uh, the bagger is plastic the tires and stuff and the steering wheel are it's really nice they don't make toys like this anymore this is actually made here guys it's not made in China nothing wrong with China toys they're great but this is kind of solid. Uh, the little turtle guy on there. Yeah, this is made, I think I'm saying it right, extra all. And there's a big freaking bug crawling on my leg. Ah, uh, jeez. Maybe mosquitoes, I'm not sure, but it's made by the extra all company. And uh, these guys made a lot of toy tractors, everything from John Deere's and stuff. They also made farm animals and stuff, I believe. But yeah, here's the back. Yeah, I thought this was cute. Another thing about these, they're numbered. So I think mine was the 968th that came off the assembly line. I hope you can see that. Yeah, these are, oh, there it is. Can you see that okay? It says 1988. I don't really have good focus on my camera. Oh, uh, this is the end of the vid. I do have Stanford manuals service manuals if anyone needs them that sees this video and I'll just email them to you in the PDF file these are such fun little tractors to work on once you get used to them and yeah even if you have one with a bad deck or something they're still fun to use as go-karts and stuff and just drive around if you got like a small yard yeah the older old uh, mowers I know a lot of people are getting them the young kids and stuff on the internet and see videos and stuff and then I think they're starting to realize this old stuff is a lot uh, more solid than the 
the newer stuff it's together it's, it doesn't break as easy but I'll end with that you guys take care I'll let you go I'm gonna do two videos today this and the cooking video you guys take care God bless hope you, you get some projects and stuff for the summer and have a good summer and just enjoy it as uh, summers only come once a year just enjoy your summer take care guys bye